conspiracy theory confirmed. The U.S. government has finally recognized the existence of Area 51. According to recently declassified documents obtained by the National Security Archive at George Washington University, the military air base is 125 miles northwest of Las Vegas. Until now, it never officially existed, with all references to the area redacted from government files. They're no longer pretending the place doesn't exist. That's the first step to getting a lot more information in the future. That secrecy made the site the frequent subject of conspiracy theories, particularly that it was used to secretly hide alien spaceships dramatized on TV and in movies. Take my word for it, there's no Area 51. That's not entirely accurate. No mention of flying saucers in the documents, but instead a different kind of flying. Turns out Area 51 was created as a test site for the Lockheed U-2, a spy plane used by the CIA during the Cold War. They obviously didn't want the Soviet Union to know about it, and to ensure that they wanted a facility where it could be tested away from everybody else. Area 51 has seen some out-of-this-world action. Apollo astronauts train there for the moon landing. Thornton Barnes, a radar and missile electronics engineer at the site, was forced to keep his work a secret from family and friends for decades.